J. Cole apologizes for Kendrick Lamar diss song, plans to erase it from streaming. Before we get into the video, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to Rap News Gossip for more amazing rap gossip. J. Cole has publicly apologized to Kendrick Lamar for dissing him on 7-Minute Drill during his electrifying performance at Dreamville Festival. Walking back his lyrics about his longtime friend Kendrick Lamar on the surprise song that was released on last week, Cole expressed regret about releasing the track. J. Cole apologizes to Kendrick. I'm so proud of that project. Except for one part. It's one part of that shit that make me feel like, man, that's the lamest shit I ever did in my fucking life, right? And I know this is not what a lot of people want to hear. I know I can hear my niggas up there right now like, nah, nah, I don't do that. But I got to keep it 100 with y'all, right? I damn near had a relapse, right? Because y'all heard some shit that happened two, two, three weeks ago, however long it was. Y'all heard that bazooka that was dropped on the motherfucking game, right? So all of this time of me moving on my own accord, for the first time I was tested. Why am I tested? Because I got the world and I got my niggas like, what you going to do, Cole? <laughs> my niggas like, bitch, boy, I must have had a thousand missed calls. Oh, my fucking God. Text flooded. I couldn't even answer my shit. Nigga, it's wartime. Right? Niggas want to see blood. And, and I was conflicted because, one, I know my heart, you know what I mean? And like, I know how I feel about my peers, these two niggas that I just been blessed to even stand beside in this game, let alone chase, chase their greatness, right? So I felt conflicted because I'm like, bro, I know I don't really feel no way. But the world want to see blood. I don't know if y'all can feel that, but the world want to see blood. So I say all of that to say, in my spirit of trying to like get this music out, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I moved in a way that was that I feel spiritually feel bad on me. Like, like I try to like jab my nigga back and I try to keep it friendly. But at the end of the day, when I listen to it and when it comes out and I see the talk, that shit don't sit right with my spirit. That shit make me feel. That shit disrupts my fucking peace. So what I want to say right here tonight is in the midst of me doing that and, and, and that shit, trying to find a little angle and downplay this, this nigga's fucking uh, catalog and his greatness, I want to say right now tonight, how many people think Kendrick Lamar is one of the greatest motherfuckers that ever touched a fucking microphone? Dreamville, y'all love Kendrick Lamar, correct? As do I. So I just want to come up here and be like, publicly be like, bro, that was the lamest, like, goofiest shit. And it make, I say all that to say, it made me feel like 10 years ago when I was moving incorrectly. And I pray that God align me back up on my purpose and on my path. You know what I mean? I pray that my nigga really didn't feel no way. And if he did, my nigga, I got my chin out. Take your best shot. I'm going to take that shit on the chin, boy. Do what you do. You know what I mean? Like, all good. Like, it's, it's love. And I pray that, you know, I pray that y'all are like, forgive a nigga for like the misstep and then, and then I can get back to my true path. Cause I ain't gonna lie to y'all, past two days felt terrible. Like, it let me know how good I've been sleeping for the past 10 years. So all of that to say, man, I wanna, I wanna now perform the song that's a reminder to me of getting back on the right path and getting in tune with God. And the name of the song is called Love Yours. I wanna do that for y'all right now. The Dreamville boss has also mentioned that he plans to remove the diss track from streaming platforms. However, it is still available for streaming at the moment. Reactions after J. Cole's apology It appears that J. Cole's apology didn't sit well with a lot of people in the hip-hop community. Terrence Punch Henderson, the president of Kendrick Lamar's former label Top Dog Entertainment, simply wrote on X, LOL. Fellow TDE executive Musa seemingly taunted Cole by posting a clip of One Republic's hit song Apologize in response to J. Cole's apology along with the caption, Sing. TDE signee reason expressed dismay by writing, IDK man, I just, IDK. While Kendrick collaborator Terrace Martin appeared to imply that Cole is soft by tweeting, 
Cotton Ball. Hit Boy also criticized the apology, writing, it might be over for real, damn. Chicago MC Mick Jenkins was especially vocal in his disapproval, tweeting, as a rapper's rapper, as a competitor, I am surprised, I am disgusted, I am disappointed. Brian B. Miller, veteran hip-hop journalist and co-host of the Rap Radar podcast, joked, might delete later, indeed. So what are your thoughts on J. Cole walking back his Kendrick Lamar disc and do you think he made the right decision? What do you think about this? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to Rap News Gossip for more updates and hit the notification bell to stay in the loop. Goodbye.